this is just really amazing and it's affirming too. Yeah. Uh, because it's about a father and a son. You know, that bond is like no other. And for this man from Fishers, it really was a battle over life or death. And tonight our Karen Campbell tells us how they overcame unrelenting odds. Is he getting me? Six-year-old Levi Galvez and his dad Giovanni have been through a lot. Riley Hospital for Children has been Levi's home for more than half his life. He was diagnosed with leukemia when he was two. That was a hard blow, you know, and realizing that your child has cancer and then it comes back again, like, how, you know? We first met the Galvez family in 2020. Levi contracted COVID. And, you know, there were many times that we felt like you were going to lose him. The emotional pain grew, all during a pandemic, as dad Giovanni worked as a patient financial counselor in the ER at Methodist Hospital. Sometimes I would work 16 hour days. Um, I would work a lot. Sometimes I would work seven days in a row, 12 days in a row. And uh, being, being in a hospital and just being in high demand because it's an active pandemic going on, I would get calls from different hospitals. Last summer, life for Giovanni took an unexpected turn. You know, things were rough in my personal life, and um, I, had, I had hit a really rock bottom. I, I worked night shift, and I got off at 6 a.m. that day. July 17th, 2021. That's when I, um, I grabbed a gun, and, you know, I shot myself, like, right here on my chest. Because I didn't want to be here anymore, you know. Things were going so well for him. You know, Levi, and, you know, I knew he would be fine, but I felt that I didn't have a place in this world anymore. But in that moment of pain, I, then that's when I didn't want to die. He drove himself to a hospital. Instead of it just destroying anything around my heart, it went straight down. Miraculously, he survived. He has no spleen, a fractured diaphragm, and broken ribs. That bullet? still lodged in his rib cage. God definitely kept me alive for a reason. Happy to you. Giovanni would later learn he was a half match for Levi's bone marrow. It feels amazing because I gave him a second chance at life. After 40 days at Riley Hospital for Children, undergoing a bone marrow transplant, Levi's transplant was a success. for a six-year-old boy and his father. Just knowing and glancing over him and imagining that he's here now and hopefully he lives a life cancer-free, it's, it's, it's because of me. And you know, it's, that's a, it's, it's amazing, it's amazing. And you know, I will always be grateful for that moment.